What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. Now, the first question y'all probably going to ask me is, am I in the bed? Mm -hmm. I'm absolutely in the bed. It is 2.25 in the morning, and I know I've been doing videos very much so late, but uh, it's hard being an entrepreneur. <clears throat> That's all I got to say. Um, hopefully, y'all enjoyed y'all cookout the other day and, and whatever you did, okay, for that holiday that they put on us, but I, I just enjoy the food part of it. Listen, we about to get into um, Bluefoot's brother, Dre. All right, now we all know that Dre, um, I don't want to say has lost his damn mind, but <clears throat> something going on, gang. And uh, I don't think none of us know what it is, but something going on. But we about to get into it. Y'all let me know what y'all think about all of this down in the comment section below. And let's get to it. Folk, you had mentioned that there might be some ill feelings with you and WAC on, like, when did that start? Did you want to give us a bit more insight around that? Yeah, so me and me and WAC's relationship, WAC is my brother's manager. I don't, I don't really deal with him too much outside of me being around my brother. But from him being around my family, he's threatened my mom a couple of different times, you know, since my mom is doing the internet stuff. And I never really felt that that was cool, you know, him talking to a woman like that. <clears throat> my mom had a... What sucks is, Dre is the only one, it seems, that has been trying to take up for his mama. Because, child, I, ain't, I haven't seen the day, uh, at least on the internet, that Blueface has. And don't get me wrong, Callie will hold her down. But Dre, he'll put them hands on anybody for his mama. After That's that fight, to be. my mom had ended up with one of my brother's chains, and I guess my brother had whack called to get it back, or so I don't know how whack got on the phone with my mom. But he basically said a lot of violent things to my mom, talking about X, Y, and Z. So from then on, I kind of our relationship was always rocky. But he was my brother's manager, so I always tried to be respectful. Uh, but we did have a situation where he kind of like came at me side. Uh, I think that respectful is crazy. Do y'all do y'all think that? Although, you know, you should respect your elders. Do you feel like, but I'm grown too? Especially if you are grown. Like, I'm grown too. Put some respect on my name. Ways Because something my mom said, when my brother had that fight in Florida, when the dude jumped in the ring and um, all that stuff happened, um, my mom was yelling at all his homies. I, I didn't see no fl fight in Florida. Can y'all slide me a link if y'all seen that? I don't, I don't recall. Because it was me, if you notice, it was me and her husband were the only two that jumped in the ring to try to help him. And um, so my mom basically just flashed on everybody. She called whacking all them all types of bitches and y'all left my son. So after she had basically threatened everybody, you know, he didn't, he couldn't turn to her because she was a woman. So he turned his frustration to me. And then that same day, me and Wack got into it. So at the time, I kind of diffused the situation because me and my brother was still cool at the time. And I didn't want to cause problems with him. So I let it slide. Uh, but I ain't gonna lie, like, Wack is not one of them niggas that you, I ain't gonna say wanna let shit slide, cause I'm not gonna act like he, he a hoe out here, but I just feel like you know what you doing, especially, you're Wack, you know what you doing. I saw him after the Crazy in Love shooting. And um, when we shot the Crazy in Love thing, and at the time, I was like, Fuck my brother at the time, you know? Y'all saw me, I was pretty, uh, I was trying to, you know, go at him low-key. Low-key, them niggas was going at it. So when I saw him again, I confronted him and was like, so what's up with all the other shit he was talking about, and this and this and that? You know, just to get a foundation, because he was still talking to her, he said some stuff on Clubhouse about it. You know what I'm saying? And, and I didn't say nothing about it, I had left it alone. So now that I seen him, and it was just me and him, uh, he tried to give me some excuse but what he had said was something disrespectful so i just you know we had got in a situation so we got in a physical altercation um and i don't know what happened he he i basically hit him he didn't do nothing i'm waiting for him to fight me back now i don't know if i can believe that whack well i don't know it's a lot of videos of whack actually no, not a lot that was a lie it's a good amount of videos of whack um putting paws on other people. So I don't know why he wouldn't fight Dre and maybe it could be because it's Blueface brother or it's just Cap. It's just Cap. 
and he never fought me back, um, which was crazy because I thought for sure he was going to hit me back. But, I mean, Come he on, just camera. sat there, started beating on the glass. Security ran outside. Uh, they started splitting us up. He's screaming. I told him, like, hey, let's come to the back, you know. And But we had talked after that. You know, he told me, like, hey, you know, let bygones be bygones because he still talks to my mom. So I thought it was squashed and I thought it was over. But um, apparently, I guess it's not, you know. He's just trying to be a snake. And he was trying to just, you know. No. Dre brought all of this either back to life or to life because um, – I guess his mama said some something that made him nervous. And ever since then, he been going in about the same thing. Be a, be a snake and do a coward move because he talked to me on the phone. You feel me? He talked to me through my mom. You could have just said, hey, bro, I need that. Set up a squad while I pulled up. We'd have got down. But I guess he don't want them type of actions. He wants pulled up. We would have got down. <laughs> Niggas, is, what is going on? To do it a different way. He wanted to be snaky and play cool. And you know what I'm saying? Because I've talked to him since then several times over the phone. And I'm like, if you have this animosity, my nigga, why didn't you say something? You know what I'm saying? But you big, big and bad and all that. He, he, you know, so I just didn't really feel that because as a man, I came to him afterwards and talked to him and he said it was cool, but apparently it's not. So I don't know. Uh, so, I don't know where he's being whack right now. Uh, it shouldn't be nothing between him and whack at all, good or bad. I don't even know why they associating them together because it ain't nothing. I, th I just don't feel like it's nothing. You know, okay. like said, yeah, that's what I was going to ask you because, um, you know, that's exactly what I was going to ask you. Where are you in WAC right now um, since then? Um, so I guess you haven't spoken to him since then. You've just kind of heard about him or heard about things he said through your through your mother, right? Yeah. from his own, he, he don't like me, bro. He he he, not, he he done did some, you know what I'm saying? He, he done did some, you know what I'm saying? Uh, he on a whole nother level with it. Like I said, he was smiling in my face and he was trying to like do 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 in the streets. You know what I'm saying? But trying to tell me like it's cool. Like, no, nah, you know, that's that's bygones be bygones on the other shit. But do what in the streets when you just said he hit your back? You know, I ain't gonna speak on it because it's some other stuff, but he 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 moving See that sound contradictive. And doing street and shit. It might be a lie. And you know what I'm saying? I don't know, it's hard to explain it, but he just on a different type of time. You know, I, I don't have a problem with him, but I, it's like I said, I didn't hit him. I mean, he didn't hit me. I hit him. So I'm, I'd imagine he probably still don't like me because I hit him. Maybe he think he can't fight me. Maybe he think he can't beat me up. I don't know. Maybe he's shorter than me. And he don't like looking up to me. I don't know. Dre. <laughs> maybe because I'm sexier than him, nigga, maybe because my dick bigger. Uh -uh. Dre. <laughs> But he ain't trying to come at me as a man. He don't want to fight. He don't want to squabble. So I don't know what to do with them nigga who don't want to fight. When I hit him in his face, he didn't do nothing. He didn't want to fight then. And I'm telling him now, we got an issue. I don't get him. But I'll pull up. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you playing cool. I just, I don't fuck with that. You know, as a man, you, if, you know, we got a squabble. We can squabble, bro. It's nothing. You know? But I think he might feel like he can't win that squabble. So he don't want to fight. You know? So he want to try to convince my mom to try to set me up and do all this weird shit and throw me in the car with my brother because he's doing weird shit with my brother. That's his life, you know? But that's Throw what we- Were you in the car with your brother? Cause he doing weird shit with the brother. I'm on, I- We are now, I, I don't really talk to whack, you know? But I, I imagine he hates my guts, you know? Maybe cause I'm taller than him, maybe cause I'm more handsome than him. I don't know. You know, I don't know why Cheesy Face is mad, but Cheesy Face don't like me. Jeez. That's a lot to unpack tonight, Adre. Okay. Yeah, it was a lot for me to unpack because this incident, the crazy in love, was like a year ago. I'm like, you harboring resentment from a year ago and been seeing me like eight different times and they said, talking to me on the phone like we cool. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But hey, different strokes for different folks, you know. I'm trying to get on my Bible tip and move forward with my life, you know. The only reason we got into it before is because he disrespected me. You know what I'm saying? The well, we should have got out on the first time, but out of respect for my brother, I didn't. You know what I'm saying? But if it was an issue, bro, he should have just did it like a man and said, hey, I got an issue with the game. You know, but he didn't do that, you know? Yeah, so I guess that's kind of where you're saying, you know, I, um, that your doubt came when it comes to trusting Wack and all and all that is, is based Child on a lot of this past, yeah. right? And it's like, you know, just, yeah, I just, I just don't know whose best interest he has at heart, you know? I know him and my brother have their little differences on the low like i said you know he's a very he got like little how man. would he know if he's never around syndrome 
and my brother is a disrespectful person, so I can imagine he's probably harboring resentment towards my brother too. He probably, you know. I hear that. Now, another thing that we wanted to kind of discuss a bit here is. Uh, Carlissa had mentioned a bit earlier when we spoke, you had mentioned that. The yeah. Um, I, I, I don't know what to say anymore because I genuinely don't know if something is wrong with Dre. I don't. He, he looks sane. And looks can really be deceiving. People look fine and they got cancer and all kind of shit. So looks can be deceiving, but what is it? Like something is going on. Okay. That's all I'm saying. Uh, so Wack responded. Did you hear about his, uh, his brother though? His brother been on blogs. He don't he talk to him up. either, bro. No, but he said he beat you up, bro. Bro, the nigga just said, listen, he also said, watch this. He also said that Blueface tried to kill him, tried to kill himself. He said all kind of shit. We don't, that nigga just did 13 years. I don't even want to tell you. Whack, hold on. You didn't say if he did it or not. Did he hit you or not? Okay, that was a yes or no uh, question slash statement. Uh, what he is, because it's Blueface's brother. You no, know, but it's work on people. that too. <laughs> like, Damn. he got work, you know what I'm saying? So, in the day, this nigga, they saying they trying to put this nigga to psychiatric. Look like we got some homework to do. Oh, it ain't it, it ain't hard. Doing homework on Dre. He was a child. Uh, Dre is letting y'all know he is not bloodly or pyroid or cripply like. He telling everything. This nigga is closer to Charleston White than anybody else. Okay, so I don't think. Anytime soon, he's gonna not snitch on whatever the fuck going on. So y'all proving paperwork don't even matter. He's he's telling you he's a snitch and come on. Or it's there. That's crazy because I, I literally seen like he was making blogs about you saying that. Listen, first he started. Look, two weeks ago, it was it was. Me and his mama is trying to kill Blueface, right? Is that what it was? Yeah, sure. Me and his mama is in conspiracy. We're conspiring to kill Blueface in the county jail, right? And then it's, um, then it's, we got him on recording saying a bunch of wild, crazy shit. You know, in this picture right here, you could tell that Blueface was trying to look out for that nigga because he got on jewelry. And yeah, yeah, I'm sorry. I don't care what you say. Dre can't afford that goddamn jewelry. I feel like he, well, it, that's either Blueface's jewelry or he gave it to him. Bought it for him. Like, who wouldn't want to be up with their brother? But when your brother hating, man. Then it's some other shit, right? So I hit the mama. I said, yo, what's up with dude? She said he having a psychiatric breakdown, right? We got the text message. I got all the text messages. I said, okay. I said, what do you mean we're trying to kill Blueface? What is what you, what you telling them? Like, I don't, I'm confused. She's like, yeah, let's talk about your breakdown. What you want me to do? So they supposed to commit it to nigga about a week ago. But we don't. Supposed to commit it to nigga about a week ago is crazy to me. But I wouldn't be Fuck with dude. You know, dude ain't, he ain't right. He got a jacket on him. Did you hear about his, uh, his jacket brother? on him is hilarious. Listen, y'all let me know what y'all think about all of this down in the comment section below. Um, do you believe whack? Okay. Do you think that um Dre actually hit whack in the face and whack didn't do nothing? Uh do y'all think uh whack got a short man syndrome? Do y'all think that whack wanna be like Dre, like Dre said? Child? I'm just letting y'all know that's what dre said y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below i am done with this video love y'all appreciate y'all hell yeah